Vida. What's going on, you guys, and welcome to another episode of the Pond Chronicles. And today, I'm going to give you my top three ways to rig the Nico Winnow and any other swim bait that's out there. Some of you are asking, what is the Winnow? Well, the Winnow is one of the newest things that have come out with Nico, and it is precisely a pack. Now, you guys may have your own way to rig a swim bait. But these that I'm about to give you is something that a beginner fisherman can use all the way to the pros and has worked pretty good for me. The only way you can sell if it'll work out for you is you're going to go out and try it yourself. So this, again, is the Nico Winnow, a nice looking swim bait. And this is special, guys, and I'll get into it as soon as I'm finished with you three ways. Up first, a traditional Texas rig. You basically have Texas rig, you take an offset worm hook, extra wide gap hook, straight hook, however you want to do it. Tie it on the end of your line. And I generally use a Palomar or a Uninop to, to rig these up. And just like any other plastic out there, I'm going to come in up right here. I'm going to go through the nose and mouth all the way to the bottom of the hook and then I'll bring it up you get a good measure here as to where your hooks gonna come out at stick it in there and then bring it down to the bottom like so so something else I like to do with these is I like to take that bait and actually push it up and over that eyelet hole. One, it kind of secures it more, and two, I think it looks a little bit better. You take a bullet weight. Big side goes toward your bait. What's the perks of the Texas rig for the winnow? You can fish it in many ways. You can bounce it off the bottom you can slowly retrieve it. Or if you don't want to use something like this, you want to add something to it. Well, something else I like to do is just take a bobber stop, put it right here at the top of your bullet weight. That way it secures the weight, gives you a little bit more action, flush up with the window, and you can do a retrieving method just like any other way. So that's way number one, the Texas rig. The next way is just get you a weighted hook with an underspin down here at the bottom. This happens to be a 4 aught underspinner with, uh, that came from Titan Tungsten. And again, you're going to do it the same way. Then basically, all you're going to do is just put it on here and screw it in that screw top lock here. Once you get it down there all the way, again, you're going to do it just like a Texas rig, line it up where you want it to go, then I'll go in the bottom of it, take and bam. Then you can always put a little bit of the plastic over it to kind of make it more weedless, but that's simple. All you gotta do is just like that. Then you can take and just slow retrieve it, fast retrieve it, let it drop a little bit. The world is your oyster when it comes to rigging these. That's number two. Now. You saw the Texas rig, you saw the blade, the swim bait hook with the underspin. Let's get to the last one. Now, this last method is something everybody uses in some shape or form. Whether it be jigs, swim baits, chatter baits, buzz baits, whatever, everybody uses this. And that is the trailer. Push it all the way up and basically you put it on the head, you've got your nice long trailer. Nice long trailer. What's so special about the winnow? What is exactly so special about the winnow, a regular swim bait that can be used and rigged up by any other one? Guys, this is the exact same winnow that I've used for this entire video. What do I mean by that? These are super, super durable. You can rig them up 
Texas rig, the underspan trailer, or even go top water with just a regular Texas rig because number one, they are durable. And number two, they float. Now, what do you mean by durable? This is your window. You see, I can't, I'm almost, I had to just lean back a little bit. Just like that. Durable. Durable, durable, durable. I mean, the fish will bite it and you could pretty much abuse it. You can rig this anyway. And it'll still look brand hammer new just like you took it out of the bag. Now, guys, there's three ways to rig the Nico Bates Winnow. Try it out for yourself. If you've got another way you could rig these, put it down below in the comments. So now that you've seen the rigging videos, let's go out and do some fishing. Let's see if we can ring the dinner bell with these. So if you like this video, check out the rest of the channel. Smash that thumbs up button. If you hadn't already, hit that red button there on the right hand side that locks you in. Makes you become another member of the Pond Predator Nation. And so that you can be one of the first people to know when the next episode of the Pond Chronicles drops. Hit that bell on the right hand side. So guys, happy new year. Hope you had a great holidays. And until next time, give a man a fish. He'll eat for a day. But teach him, and he'll never go hungry again. Tight lines, everybody. Later.